Hello everyone, this is Just a Dad. Today I'm gonna do a comparison between this Kenmore and this Bissell Crosswave Max. Here we've got a big mess with some muddy dog prints, some SpaghettiOs, and some grape wine. Let's try this out. Turn them on. Now the Bissell, I gotta press a trigger to let the solution out. The Kenmore is automatic. You know, the Kenmore did a little bit better job, and it's super lightweight. Yeah, the Kenmore is doing a little bit better job. Really lightweight. My... After you're done, you can just mop your floor now with it. They both turn real easy. But the Bissell is kind of heavy. And again, I gotta pull a trigger to let the solution out. Okay, so see how we gotta make, we gotta fix your, clean up your muddy dog prints. That's okay though. Yeah, I, I did think the Kenmore cleaned a little bit better. So now there's the charging basis. So let's put the Kenmore on. When we put it on, it's gonna start charging it. The Kenmore does have a nice display a power button and a mode button. There is no trigger for solution. It puts the solution down automatically. Now the Bissell is a little bit heavier. It's gonna put it on the base and it's gonna start charging also. Now it had a trigger that I was pushing right here for solution, a power button and a mode button. So let's do the self-cleaning feature. And up here, there's a self-cleaning button. Okay, so the Bissell takes about a minute. This takes about two minutes for the Kenmore. Okay, so let's see how they did. Here's the Kenmore dirty water tank. We're gonna clean these out. Here's the Bissell. Now they both have a clean water tank around back right here and the Kenmore's got one right there. You're gonna put the water and solution in. Now let's open this up. The Kenmore can get a little closer to the edge. Yeah, it did a good job cleaning the roller. Let's take this off. Yeah, this one did a pretty good job too. Now what you hear over here is the Kenmore has a little blower that's gonna dry this for four hours. It's not heated, but it does blow air out of these vents right here, right onto the roller. I can turn that off right there. Okay, so let's empty out the, the Kenmore first, take that off, empty everything out. We can rinse this all out. It does have a filter once in a while. You are gonna have to clean this filter and rinse all that out. Now it's time to do the Bissell, same thing. Empty everything out. And then we got a filter. Sometimes we gotta rinse this filter off and make sure it's dry before we put it back in. Okay, so both of these retail for about $300. They're both on sale for $270. That Bissell is a beast. I don't like it. I actually don't know why, I don't know why somebody would buy it when they've got, it's, it's been around a long time. It's just super heavy and you gotta pull the trigger I actually, you know, you could see when it was cleaning, you know, it just, I don't think it was cleaning as good. You know, the self-cleaning only lasted about half as much, but these things have come, these wet, dry floor mops have come a long way. Kenmore just released this 2024. I think that Bissell's been around three or four years. There've been lots of improvements and advance, advancements. I like the display. You know, this one connects to the Wi-Fi. You, know, you don't need to connect to the Wi-Fi with these. The buttons again, it doesn't have a trigger. This one, you gotta remember to put the solution down. These, you just pick up and go. They do the job. I really do like that Kenmore. I bought both of these with my own money. If I had $270, I would buy the Kenmore. I'll put links to, links to both of these in the show description notes. And again, I cannot stress enough how heavy that Bissell Crosswave Max is. Be sure and check me out over on Instagram. I got I do free giveaways over on Instagram, just to dad, look for my logo, and on my Facebook group page. When I'm done with these products, I do give them away for free. 
I really appreciate everybody's support. I really do love what I do. I love comparing these. There's just, there's so much difference. For the same price, you definitely got to get the Kenmore. So I'm doing robot vacuums also. I got lots of videos on robot vacuums, those really expensive ones. The videos are kind of long, but there's just a lot to them. So I hope you really do like my videos and I hope they help people. That's the purpose of my videos. I want to help people. So again, I really do appreciate everybody's support. If you could hit the like button, subscribe, and thanks for watching. That one popped out. That was my fault for not having it in there all the way. Let's try that again. <laughs>